Hey guys, I'm going to show you one of the benefits of uh, having the OBD2 slash math swap done on uh, your MX6 or your probe, or I guess uh, early 626. Um, my car is a 93, so it's OBD1, but I can, uh, I can run like OBD2 live data like Torque, which is a cell phone app that you can get. I think it only costs about $5. You just need a, an adapter to run torque via Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. I'm running a Bluetooth one. You can probably see the little lights down there. That's my adapter. Uh, the adapter itself, I think, was about $12. I mean, it's a really neat little tool you can use, and especially, you know, it, it unlocks, you know, the OBD, you know, well, I mean, it, it unlocks, like, you know, everything that you can view on the OBD2 ECU because everything that the OBD2 ECU reads and monitors, you can read monitor on this app. So, like uh, for instance, on my main screen here, I have a coolant temp, intake, air temp, ignition timing, advance, RPM, uh, my ECU read for speed, um, my MAF cubic feet per minute, and then my throttle percentage. And uh, I mean, the refresh rate on it's a little slow because uh, it's an older ECU, and generally with older ECUs, the refresh rate's a little slow. But everything's there, and it's I mean, fairly quick. Like I'll jump up to full throttle real quick here, and. See, it takes a second, but everything will read. And uh, you can also use this as a scanner. It'll scan any codes that you have. You can run um, live data, like graphing and everything. There's a bunch more. I haven't even played with the app completely yet, but um, like you can anything you can think of. Like you can even read O2, um, O2 sensor voltages. Like uh, right there, that's my O2 sensor voltages as of you know me going on the screen right now. They all read the same. I think they'll read. They'll read about the same. I only this car only runs 102. Or, yeah, this car only runs 202 sensors, which uh, the Millennia ECU, which is what this cape, the my ECU is, it, it runs I think three. So I just have all three pulled up. But uh, you know, that's the main bit of it there. And like I said, it's a really neat tool to use, especially um, you know, I mean, just like just the, the the coolness factor of it. You know, having this whole extra set of gauges that you can use. It also monitors vacuum and. Um, once I go turbo, I'm going to see if the vacuum gauge will actually read boost off the ECU. Um, I'm not 100% certain if this ECU is capable of reading boost or not, but I mean, I'm sure it could be. But, uh, like I said, like, it's, it's a really neat thing to have. The app is called Torque. Um, you can get it on, I think, I, iPhone and uh, Android. So, um, you know, it's pretty neat, especially when, you know, when you explain to somebody who knows about cars what it is and... You know, they're like, oh, that's cool, you're OBD2 swapped, and you can do all that, and your car's old, and, you know, it's it's just a pretty neat thing to have. So, uh, I figured I'd share that with you guys, this, um, you know, this little deal here. So, if you ever get the map swap, you can run torque and run live data and, you know, full OBD2 capabilities. That's just one of the perks of having it. So, yeah, this is uh, the OBD1 93 Mazda MX-6 running an OBD2 live data stream. Thanks for watching.